Hello there. So it's my favorite day of the week. It's date night. And I wanted to give you guys a tip on how to make date night not be such a hassle, whether it be you do the same boring things over and over and over, or you have that couple thing that usually happens where he says, where should we go? She says, I don't know. He says, let's go here. She says, I don't want to, and all of that. Um, <laughs> the way that my husband and I finally figured out to get rid of that, because if it was up to me, I would make all the decisions. And if it was up to him, he would let me in, in where to eat and not other things. But uh, anyways, the way that we figured out to get rid of that whole hassle, where sometimes we'd even just get in an argument because nobody would decide, uh, is every other time we go on a date, it's his turn or my turn. And so we switch off every other time. Uh, last week it was my turn to plan it and figure out where we were going, what we were doing and all of that. This week it's his turn, yeah. I love this day because I don't have to think about it. I just get to show up or actually he gets to show up and pick me up and then we go. But anyways, uh, super fun. And so I hope you are going on date night with your spouse and you're just loving it. And it's a great way to come together and connect. It's a great way to, especially if you have little kids or those middle-aged kids or those teenage kids that can be so hard sometimes. Um, it's a great way for you as a couple to connect and not let the kids be your, the center of your life because at some point they are gonna leave home and then you and your spouse have just you. And so you've gotta learn to, you know, date each other and get all excited about date night and have alone time and be husband and wife, all right? So that's my tip for the day. Hope you're having a great day and I hope you have a wonderful weekend and I will talk to you soon. Bye.